didn't have to call to tell me that. Not you! The Dieter Sachs door detective! There's been a misunderstanding. I need you to help clear it up. Oh, now you want me. All right, I'm coming. The one phone call rule is for real policemen. You worthless turd. You had that opportunity. I said get off me, you stupid bastard. I told you, she's a biter. That's assault on top of the shoplifting beef. Man, the paperwork. Get out of the car! Shit! Ah, All right, let's go! Let's go! I do not want to go to prison! I'm on top of it. They're coming, Michael! Chill out. It's under control. Whoa. The cops are still after us! I'm on top of it. Get us out of here! Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. Hello? No seatbelt! Go, 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 go! I'm on top of it. Come on, come on! Come on! Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. Is that it? Are they gone? Of course they're gone. Who are you talking to? Come on, I'll take you back to the house. Don't say it! What? That I have everything I want, so why am I stealing? Oh, my lips are sealed! Because if you say that, I'll say the same to you! I'm not saying anything! I'm just doing my best to keep us out of jail! Can we drive home, please? I mean, who are you to judge me? Oh, I'm not judging? No, not at all. You're loving this, aren't you? Oh, yeah. Risking prison, getting shot at, love, love, big love. Great! Real inconspicuous! So this is what it's like to be you. Uh, not really, honey. See, I'm a semi-successful crook. You're a bit of a failure, but hey, kudos for trying. Not that successful if you're in witness protection. Well, I've got an idea. Why don't we see what Agent Dave and the FIB think of this Lovers on the Run act? Where are you going? You know, I'm sort of thankful for this. Thankful? This is the worst day of my life. Ah, oh, come on, you're doing your part. Your spending habits have got us into a sticky financial situation, so you're cutting corners. Really? My spending habits? I've seen your day trader account. Oh, hey, that's private. I swear, password protection, it ain't even sacred no more. Give it up. You pissed our savings down the toilet. Really? Our savings? Yeah, our savings. I gave up everything to start this life with you, you selfish shit. Yeah, <laughs> okay, all right, whatever. Our savings. It's just, look, you can't look at the day-by-day -day figures. You gotta look at the overall, the, you know, the net figure. I've seen the net. It's a fucking disgrace. Hey, I'm bringing it around. Sure you are. Just please give me some warning before they repossess. It ain't that bad. Couple of weeks. A day, even. I don't want to be there. Honey, we're fine. Sure. Are we going home? Get rid of the car, Michael. It can't stay in the driveway. Oh, and... Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, who's this? It's Ricky from Life Invader. I know you're the bro who deactivated Jay, bro. <laughs> oh, I have no idea what you're talking about, pal. What you do's your business, bro. Anyway, Jay really got a big head once people started calling him a god. Guess you proved he wasn't one. They reintegrated my team in Burundi after the design got signed off. And now, my shares ain't worth dick. Sorry about that. I need work. And I thought maybe you could provide. I mean, I'm smart enough to track you down, aren't I? I guess you are. Hey, I'll be in touch if anything comes up. The hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. Now, they say it cannot be hit. Hasn't been yet. 
Look, I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Matrazzo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Oh, well, gems it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but uh, yeah, he went quiet. All right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. Hello? We're going to Little Portola. Your FIB buddies, they, uh, know you're back in business? FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. But for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Oh, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident. The shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Here we are. Hey! Analyzing Hamlet to yourself again? Whatever. Mm -hmm. Okay, we need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. Sweetie! Hey, man. Sir, thank you. The alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, on the wall by the side door. Glasses are live, shoot away. Alarms, vents, cameras, remember? Uh, shots come through. Camera, check. Alarm, check. Vents, check. Good work. Now speak to the assistant and see if there's anything else we need to know. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe 10 grand. Our rings start at 8, our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. Hey! You best lay low, bitch! Die pain! So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Hey there! Drive around the block and look for a way up to the roof.
Look, there. Some construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. So, you keep up with the old crew? You know, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. I saw a ladder. Climb up it and see if you can get to the roof. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? I kept tabs on him for a while. Needed to, uh, know that he didn't blame me. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. I'm on the roof! I need to know where the air coming out of those vents in Vangelico originates. There should be a unit above the store. Hey, I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? I've pulled up a satellite image. It looks like the highest point is on the northwest side. Get a shot from there. That's the shot. You've covered the vents on the roof now. Okay, that'll do. Now come back to me before someone spots you up there. Will do. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. He's probably a John Doe then, right? What do you think? OD? Shootout? Maybe just a car crash, right? Anonymous charred remains on the highway? They only knew what a sick puppy they had on their hands. Let's hurry this up, Michael. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told him to start setting up the information. So, what did you see? Uh, nothing that'll cause undue compl complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. You might be able to wipe them remotely. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes who rub his nose in it. Good. Alarm system's linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window if someone talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register. So I'd start there. Mm, glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof. Means you can smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open, then? Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. I might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. You know what they say. It's your funeral. One of them, at least. <laughs> Workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Don't wanna leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right, not for a pro. <laughs> well, mapping out the options. I'm showing you all the angles. That's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions. That is your domain, my friend. Here. Now, there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? 
If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. It means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LS. PD tactical team, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the LS River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? Ah, you've grown wise and cautious in your old age. Okay. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the... Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Eddie Cho. Now you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't make much difference. Gus Moda. He's a pro. Not much else to say. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. This guy, Ricky. I met him at the Life Invader office. He may not be that good, but he's enthusiastic. Harris. <laughs> good. Feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. That look good to you? Are you sure? Great. Uh, I'll do some research on a pest control van and the knockout gas, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes. Huh? Good. Good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa. What? My rep don't count for nothing no more? You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you. 